Motivation. Motivation is just motivating yourself to do something. Like, why are you doing something? Like, for me, I can only speak to you how things affect me, make it right. And that is my family, my wife, my three kids, the future. Uh, what do I want to accomplish? Captain Jack. This is what motivates me to get up every single day. And also, it's sort of like... I made this lawn care stuff into basketball or football, which is my two favorite sports. It's how I see my entire life was through the lens of sports. And so I, ch I literally used my imagination to make lawn care the same thing, make it right. Here's what I mean. Right now, where are me and Captain Jack at? To you, on this camera, what you see is us inside the truck right captain jack's here he's driving he's doing that but in my brain this is the locker room we're in a locker room right now we're, we're we're thinking about our game plan as we head to our next game all right so now we're in our locker room we talking we, this is where we have fun this is just like when you're in high school i can only talk about high school in one year at like small like a small little Division three college, all right? This is all I can talk about. But inside that locker room was where all of the fun happens, honestly. It ain't really the game. The game has some some semblance of stress in it. But when you're in the locker room, everything is like still fantasy. And all you can think about is like, what you're gonna do in the game, like what the game's gonna be, like how many people are gonna be there, you know, what kind of Gatorade that the trainer is gonna make this, this you know for this game or whatever that's all the type of things that happen in the locker room you're talking about video games and all of that type of stuff so that's the locker room that's the truck that's where we're at now now we're on our way to our next property that's the game that's the game i don't have to explain the game you know what the game is the game is playing man the game is putting a ball in the hoop passing it to your teammate getting the rebound clearing the rebound uh you know playing defense doing all of these different things that are in the game that's all of the different aspects of the 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 actual property that you're on the, you know some the grass might be tall the might the shrubs might need trim there might be a mulch install all of these different things are different aspects of the game that's how i see it and then after the game and even before the game you have to look at the game tape now what is the game tape to me the game tape is you know youtube videos all of the studying that i've done watching all of the big youtube people that you know before i even ever thought or dreamt about putting my own video up but all of all of all of the brian law maintenance videos all of the keith kalfas videos all of the long hair rookie videos like Spencer and Savannah, we, we talk about them because they're the most popular people. That's the only reason I bring them up. They're all fabulous people. Um, and they're all doing exactly what I wanted to do, which just is just live their dream. Any podcast that you listen to, like all of this stuff is study. And I said to my brother one time, I was trying to explain something to him. And my brother played sports his whole life, too. That was like our way to, to be normal because we grew up rough <laughs> you know so our way to be normal was like we're normal on the basketball court on the football field for him even on the baseball uh diamond like he this is what we did you know what i mean um so watching the game tape was like i was watching all of michael jordan's games uh barry sanders all of that but i was talking to my brother one day and I was trying to get through to him. Like, I've been trying to get him to start a business and, 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 and to do what I'm doing. Not exactly what I'm doing, but to just start a business. And I said to him one day, what I'm saying to you is not like, I ain't trying to tell you what to do, but it's just a part of the game tape. And if you can hear me and, and, and I can tell you some of my trials and tribulations, some of my successes as well, then that's the game tape for you. It's just like Ray Lewis watching the game tape on Peyton Manning. Peyton Manning's also watching the game tape on Ray Lewis. So they're going back and forth, you know, but that's because they've learned and they've watched so many things over the course of so many years that now they just kind of know what to do. Like it's second nature because they've been watching the game tape. They've been in the locker room. And then they played so many games. So that's exactly how I see lawn care. That's exactly how I see really any business. Every business is like that. 
And because I've always looked up to athletes, it's like when you think of about a person like a LeBron James or a Tom Brady, it's like they get to call their own shot now because they've been doing something consistently for so long. They've been great at something for so long that now they get to tell people what players they want to play with. They get to go talk to the like talk to exactly to the coach, talking to the owners because they've earned that. You can do that too. It's the same thing with your brand. Like you've been in the game for a while. Now you can call your shot. You started out, you didn't you was on a on a terrible team. You got drafted to the worst team. You probably didn't have no equipment. You probably didn't have a nice truck or a trailer or any of that stuff. But then you kept you kept doing it. You kept watching the game tape. You kept going to practice. You kept being in the locker room. You kept uh, doing the game you in the game you was trying to do everything fundamentally right and correct because you've watched so much game tape and you've seen the people who are successful this is exactly how i've lived my entire life and so use your imagination to figure out what it is that you love doing and then you can i think metamorphosis is the right word but you can metamorphosis you can manifest that's the better word you can manifest that thing that you see in your head you can manifest it in reality and that's all i did that's all I've been doing and that's all I continue to do. And that's why this whole thing, I always say it's an improv show. I, I never know, but I do watch the game tape so that whenever something happens in this improv show that we live in every single day, I can make the adjustment because I've seen it before. I watch so much game tape. So I hope that helps someone. If it did, like, subscribe, follow, hit that notification bell. And as always, I love you. I appreciate you and I wish you nothing but success. And I'm out. Peace.